it's Nicole from Paperback Princess here with another Showcase Sunday. Um, big things have kind of happened this week. Um, I live on the East Coast. Um, I'm from New York. And we, my area got hit, um, not horribly by Sandy, but um, I was lacking power for a week, which I know is um, not as bad as some other people have had it. And um, they're in my prayers. Um as it is, but I didn't have power for a week, so um, I'm still looking to hit that 200 followers um, so I can show you guys what I got at New York Comic Con and have a big giveaway. Um, that being said, so for the last week, I really haven't been able to push that. Um, I'm back now, back online, power, heat, everything. Um, it's pretty wonderful. Um, but like I said, prayers to everyone that's still struggling with the aftermath of the storm. I have a friend. Um, on Staten Island, who I've heard from her, I know that she's still, um, she's okay, but I don't know if her house is still there or what's going on with her. Um, so it's, it's a very jarring and scary time. So, um, without further ado, um, some of the, I've been gone, I, well, besides not having power for the last week, I was out of town for the week before that, um, and in that time I got a whole bunch of books. Um, I'm sure you saw the showcase Sunday from last week, which was really crazy. Um, I hope you did watch it. Um, there was a surprise at the end if you watched the full show. So, um, like I said, without further ado, um, one of the books that I got was Shadowlands by Kate Bryan. Um, I'm really excited about this. Uh, there's a killer on the loose and witness protection, and it's really exciting. Um, I'm really excited for that. Um, it sounds really great. Um, so there's that. I also got Nerve by, um, Jean or Janine, uh, Ryan. Um, this came out in September. Um, it sounds like a, it's a video game and you broadcast online. Um, I've heard mixed things about this book, so can't wait to get, check that one out. Um, next up is Pretty Girl 13 by Liz Coley. Um, this girl was, uh, kidnapped when she was 13, and then, um, it's about her finding herself. Um, I'm excited to get to read this book. I read, um, last November, I read, um, not Elizabeth Smart, um, I can't remember the name of the book now, um, and the name of the girl that went missing. Oh, J.C. Duggard, or, Yeah. J.C. Duggard, um, she, uh, I read her book about her time being kidnapped for 18 years, so, um, something tells me this might be similar, except more in the fiction sense, um, so I'm kind of excited for that, well, not kind of, I am excited for that one. Um, next up is Seventeen and Gone by Nova Ren Suma, um, I also have her book Imaginary Girls, which unfortunately I haven't gotten to yet. Um, but I can't wait to check that out. This book comes out in March, and this one is signed. Um, I got really excited. I'm really excited about this. Um, I've heard really great things about that, and uh, apparently she's from New York, so I hope she fared well in the storm. Um, and you know, like Lauren Stefano still doesn't have power, so it's a rough, it was a rough, rough storm. Um, next up, which I've been really looking forward to, unfortunately I haven't read her first book, Between Shades of Grey, but I do have Out of the Easy by Ruta uh, Septis. Um, I do have Between Shades of Grey. It's one of the books that I got from BEA that I've slowly but surely been working towards. Um, but this one um, was out at uh, San Diego Comic-Con, and... Um, I'm just excited to get this one and check it out. This is um, coming out in February, so this one is an exciting one also. Um, another 2013 release that I got, actually, yeah, I just have one more after this one, um, is Etiquette and Espionage by Gail Carriger. Um, I'm really excited for this one. Um, I haven't checked out the original series, which this is based on, which is the Parasol Protectorate. Um, I've heard good things about it. I am looking to check it out. Um, but eventually, eventually I'll get there. This one, she looks pretty badass. I mean, she's holding a pair of scissors, and she's all finely dressed. 
Um, this comes out in February as well, so I can't wait to check that out. That one looks really good. Um, my last 2013 release is comes out in March. It's Unremembered by Jessica Brody. Um, it's about a girl who loses her memory in a car crash, in a, um, not car crash, a um, plane crash. So I'm excited to check this out. Um, it looks really, really great and exciting. And um, I can't wait to get to that one. Um, I also received this week, Touched by Corinne Jackson. Um, I've been looking forward to this. This actually comes out this month, I believe the 27th. Um, so I'm basically using my time. I'm, this is one of the, I'm going to be reading this very, very soon. Um, very soon. Um, it's about a young girl uh, with the power to heal people, but when she heals them, she takes on their own injuries. Um, sort of reminds me of Beautiful Lies, except that she takes on the injury as opposed to um, getting the injuries of her sister. So there's that. Um, next up is... A Desire Path by uh, Jan Shapin. Um, I'm going to be... Oh, there's a note in here. Um, I didn't even notice that, which is so awful of me. Um, I got this because I'm going to be doing a, a blog tour for this book in December, on December 10th. It's um, about a, a union organizer and um, this woman that he has an affair with, Anna, and... Excited to check it out. Um, this is brought to you by TLC Book Tours. Um, so I'll read that one. Is this signed? No, this one is not signed. All right. And last but not least is another tour book. Um, probably less exciting. Um, we've got A Lincoln Conspiracy by Timothy O'Brien. Um, this is really... Um, it's a Lincoln book. Um, I love history. It's historical fiction. Um... This is brought to you by uh, Historical Fiction uh, Virtual Tours. Um, her blog is actually called Passages to the Past. But um, another book I'm really excited about, I'm going to be doing a giveaway for this one as well. Keep an eye out for that. That's also going to be in uh, December. Um, upcoming things we've got, we've got a Monument 14 giveaway to still do. We've got an ARC and we have an audiobook. We still have my New York Comic Con giveaway once I hit 200 followers. And we also have several posts, blog tours, and uh, exciting things, including a signed Reach poster, which can be yours. Um, I'm suffering from a cold right now, so I apologize. Um, so all in all, um, not too bad this week. And um, I hope everyone else is doing as well. I hope everyone got just as good books, leave me a link to your Showcase Sunday or Stacking the Shelves or your book haul or whatever you call it. And um, I'll be sure to check it out and see what you got this week. Thanks again for watching.